I come from childhood, Brighton, a city cut in half by the sea. To stand on shore one has two scenes to look at. City, loud, vibrant, violent, chaos, cash and carry, fast food, tramps, manners, lights, so many lights. Street lights, traffic lights, tanning lights, shop lights, bar lights, f- bar fights. Crowds, crammed, coughing, cackling, creating, crushing, causing litter. The sea, the sea. Cool, calm, immense, suspense of the next wave, a slave to natural, eternal forces, courses across the face of the earth. Vast, constantly dynamic, yet never changing. They say worse things happen at sea. They are wrong. The sea does not mug, or stab, or argue, or intend harm, or shout, or swear, or stare with lustful, mistrustful glares. The city infects the sea. It clutters and competes at it. It battles calm and vexes the shore till sore and shows the worst that we can be. And the sea forgives. Forgives forever, for always, because it was there before and it will be thereafter. It forgives us the infancy of our race as we race towards adolescence.